Hello guys, my name is Azariah, and uh, today we're going to talk about uh, my project. So, um, it's about uh, how does hope have to do with exercise, and what my opinion is on it, and personally. So basically, um, the mentors kind of asked this question, which is, what's your opinion on hope? And I kind of said, it's basically a mindset, which is what you believe, what you trust in God, down below. And I kind of made this example of, um, it's kind of, it's like, if a relative passes away, then you basically are not going to have a really good mindset. You're not going to, you're going to feel down a lot. You're not going to, you know, you're not going to feel well. So, um, you kind of have to have this good mindset to get, like, God has this plan for you and he's going to do something for you. That's why. He made this happen. That's why he did this. So you just got to trust in God and have the right mindset to do it with you. So on the, on the exercise part, uh, kind of my opinion on it, I hope has to do with it. It's mostly, and again, it's the mindset. But um, it's really, it's down to your choice. Like, um, if you have a good choice to do it, you have a good goals and everything you're gonna be able to do it because you have the hope and you're trusting god that's gonna happen but also it's down to your function function you have to be able to encourage yourself you have to be able to do it and reach your goals not i mean god will help you but you also have to encourage yourself and do that stuff but um yeah so basically i have a little bit of uh benefits of exercise um just kind of an ad thing. Um, help you control your body weight. Reduce your risk of heart disease. Help your body manage blood sugar and insulin levels. And then this one's kind of interesting. Uh, but help you quit smoking because it kind of, kind of distracts you and everything. And then improve your mental health and mood. Which is another good one. And then help keep thinking. Help, help keep your thinking, learning, and judgment skills sharp as you age. As you age. And then strengthen your bones and muscles, which is obvious because you're working out and getting the protein you need. And then reduce your risk of some cancers, which is, I think I said, breast cancer and some others. But reduce your risk of falls because it will, basically that's saying you're, when you do like lunges or something, squats, you're basically having, you're basically, your body's going to be able to balance better instead of falling all the time, like, you're walking better and everything. And then improve your sleep, which I'm just kind of obvious. You're kind of, at the end of the day, you're going to be more tired. So you're going to go to sleep way better. And then increases your chance of living longer, which that reduces the, the fat, which is going to make you live longer because we're just the, everything just kind of connects. It reduces the diabetes, then reduces that. So basically, you know. And then after this, I'll have a little bit of exercises. Okay, now we're gonna do some exercises. First, we're gonna start off with the diamond push-ups. These work the triceps, they're outside of your arm. So, first we're gonna do it like this. Now you just do a couple of those, like 12, 12. I usually do three sets of 12. All right, now we're just gonna do regular push-ups, uh, three sets of 12. And they're gonna be they're gonna work through your chest, your back, and your triceps. So yeah. all right. okay, now all you need is just a chair. You can probably get that from your house, simple. And then now we're gonna just do uh tricep dips. So go like this. These are with your triceps, just like this. You can do them like this too, if you want, or you can do it like this. I prefer this, it's a little bit harder. Alright. Alright, now we're going to start up with the abs. We're going to do uh, 15, or three sets of 15. So just regular sit-ups, just like this. And you can get someone to help you. If you want. Now we're going to do uh, three 
sets of 20 of crunches. It's pretty simple, just with the abs. exercises of uh, uh, basically the legs so first I'm just gonna do lunges 15 or two sets of 15 so just go basically going to do uh, the lunge, or, um, squats, we're basically going to do, it's going to work your calves, your hamstrings, and your quads, just like these, basically just go. Now these ones, uh, this is choice. But like I said, in the benefits, you can help your balance. These ones kind of help your explosiveness, like me, I'm a soccer player, so they can kind of help you. I'm gonna do three sets of 15, so you go, boom. Just go in and out, and switch. guys for watching this video and I hope so this just helps you during quarantine just keep your mind off of all the boring stuff so thank you